Hello everybody, today we are looking at powers and roots, so writing things in what we call index form, so that's as powers, okay? So, when two numbers are multiplied together, which have the same, basically, number or same base, then we can write them as a power. So, for example, if I said 4 times 4 times 4, now I could do 4 times 4 times 4, and it's going to give me 64, but ultimately I can write also write that as a, a, a product in index form, so that is 4 cubed, Okay. Um, similarly, obviously, the longer it kind of gets, the more relevant, obviously, using it is. So, 7 times 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 7 is 7 to the power of 8. Um, and then over here, you've got, obviously, there's going to be 4 there, so 2 to the power of 4. And then, if you've got different ones, well, we can't bring them together, so we have to leave them separate. So, you've got 3 to the power of 4 and 5 cubed, hence written like so. Um, and it says, common when numbers are in index form, that the base, a big number, is a prime number, all right? So that comes into play when we talk about um, products. Well, a prime factor trees essentially, all right? So if you're not quite sure what I'm talking about there, please have a look at the a lesson on prime factor trees because that comes into that particular thing, all right? So here, rather than writing eight, we would tend to write that as two cubed and then obviously five cubed, all right? So products of primes or prime factor trees is really what was the, this kind of way that kind of comes into play, okay? So powers. So literally, it is just a small number. It tells you how many times you must multiply the big number by itself. Um, so 6 to the power of 4 is obviously 6 times 6 times 6 times 6. Um, and then squaring a number means you times it by itself. So that's to the power of 2. And so 12 squared is 12 times 12. And then cubing a number, so these are just common terms, means you times it by itself three times. So, the, so squaring and cubed, they have their own specific little words. Everything else doesn't. It's normally just anything to a power of, all right? But anything to a power one is just itself. So 8 to the power one is 8, 3 to the power one is 3, and 21 to the power one is 21. So you tend not to see it written. But obviously it exists, but we don't write it. And then another very, very important one, um, which you need to be aware of, is anything to the power zero is one, all right? And by all means, you can check this with a calculator, but no matter what you put in your calculator, if you put, therefore, to the power zero, it will give you one, all right? So, 7 to the power of 0 is 1, 4 to the power of 0 is 1, x to the power of 0 is 1, 2486 to the power of 0 is 1, so everything to the power of 0 is 1, okay? Roots, well, roots are the opposite powers, it's just kind of working back the other way. So, that tends to be the symbol of a square root, essentially, and of course, from there, if you need to add an additional number to a cube root, fourth root, then you'd literally put a little number on top of it, all right? So the square root of 25 is root 25 plus 5, because 5 times 5 is 25. So you, it's kind of working backwards. And a lot of these, you'll just need to learn these numbers and familiarize yourself. But cube rooting a number is the opposite of cubing a number, all right? And you'll see the little cube root sign, which is over here, like with a little 3. Um, and again, same kind of thing. It is the working backwards, but of course, if you don't know what the cube root of 64, then without a calculator, on, on, like you're actually knowing it, then you're going to struggle to kind of figure out what it is, all right? But essentially, it's 4 times 4 times 4, all right? So there's some of these cube numbers you need to familiarize yourself with, all right? So if you think you need practice um, on powers and roots, then please just go to mass-school.co.uk, and obviously there's a bunch of questions on there for you to practice on. Okay, thanks for listening.